from Aaron in France. Uh, Aaron says, hi, Dad. Hi, Aaron. That's my son's name, by the way. Um, the man child, that's his name. Spelled the same way, too. Um, hi, Aaron. I will soon journey uh, to Walt Disney World for a one-person vacation. Unfortunately, my skills at trip planning are next to zero. That's okay. Dad's here to help. I intend on staying there for one week, but I have no idea of the minimum amount of cash uh, for this place. I know that a family of four costs about $4,000. So I would like to know how much money would I need as a minimum for a one-person stay. Aaron, that's uh, it's kind of a hard question for me to answer because I don't know you. I don't know your spending habits. Are you somebody that wants to eat at um, Victoria and Albert's? Are you somebody that eats at Casey's Corner? You know, are you a big spender? Are you a, are you Scrooge or are you a splurger? Um, so it kind of depends on your spending habits, how much you want to spend. But as a general rule, uh, after you pay for your hotel and your tickets, after you pay for your hotel and your tickets, I figure, we figure about $100 a day per person. That's for meals, for snacks, for uh, souvenirs. It, that's kind of a, a good average if you're not a big spender. If, if you're not a big spender, you can get by with a little less than that, but $100 is a pretty good baseline if you're not a big spender. Now, if you're a big spender, if you're going to eat at table service restaurants every meal, uh, if you're going to, you know, you want to buy some really nice souvenirs and a lot of souvenirs, then figure 200 or more a day. Uh, the bottom line is there's no good way to figure out how much money you need. But what I will say is you're probably not going to have enough <laughs> because Disney is really good about reaching in your wallet and pulling that money out. And before you know it, where did that money go? Um, but, you know, $100 if you're not a big spender, $200 or more if you are a big spender. That's kind of a, a bottom line after your room and tickets. Thanks so much for watching Dad's video. For more simple, fun, magic Walt Disney World information, go to Dad's Guide to WDW.com. You can do that by clicking the i button that's popping up on the screen right now. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe to our YouTube channel and get more Dad's YouTube videos with Daditude.